Julie was warned by a policeman knocking on the window when she was sleeping in the car. Ma'am, sleeping in the car is prohibited. She emphasized that she was resting her eyes, but a pillow fell and exposed her lie. Julie was ordered by John to get out of the car. She thought she would be troubled, but John pointed to a place not far away and said, drive the car over there before sleeping. Julie was overjoyed by John's leniency. However, the appearance of another police officer made the situation suddenly serious. Jack insisted that Julie's identity was suspicious, and he asked asked for a routine inspection. John tried to stop him, but Jack warned him not to neglect his duties. Jack touches Julie in the name of inspection. Julie dared not say anything, and she was even more panicked when asked for her address. John intended to help her out, and he lied that he found the house key in the car. Julie immediately understood when she saw John's secret hint. Washington Street. Washington Street. Three. Washington Street three, okay. But Jack insisted on forcing an on-site inspection. He ordered John to wait there. They came to John's residence. No matter how Julie tried to cover up John's traces, how could she compare to Jack's careful inspection? <laughs> Jack quickly exposed Julie's lies. He took the opportunity to use his strong body to press Julie. John arrived at the critical moment. He angrily said that this was his home. Do you want to break the law? Senior officer. Jack had to let go, but he still threatened them viciously before leaving. Maybe you gotta wear his head, but as soon as she goes out the door, I'll arrest her. 